Nuriel Rubini, Mega Threats, 10 Dangerous Trends and HO. In the book, Mega Threats, 10 Dangerous Trends and HO by Nuriel Rubini, the author explores the numerous threats facing the world today. From uncontrollable debt and income disparity to artificial intelligence displacement and climate change. The book delves into these complex issues with an insightful approach, attempting to highlight the consequences of governmental and societal short-term decision-making. As you read this book's summary, you will comprehend the severity of these challenges and how interconnectedness amplifies their potential impact on a global scale. The Looming Global Debt Crisis With global debt exceeding $250 trillion and economies wheezing due to outdated and reckless economic policies, the world is on the brink of a global debt crisis. Governments and average people are addicted to debt, ignoring the long-term consequences. Private debt has reached new highs, threatening economic stability. Central banks have made money too cheap for too long, leading to a boom and bust cycle and the possibility of a recession. Without significant changes to tackle debt addiction, the future looks bleak for developed and developing economies alike. The rise of machines and the future of employment. The rise of artificial intelligence, AI, and automation is rapidly rendering traditional jobs obsolete. While this technological development promises a future of increased productivity and leisure, it also threatens long-term job displacement and inequality. Economist Rubini warns that AI will most benefit the wealthier few, ultimately widening the wealth gap. As machines gradually take over jobs that require narrow, simple tasks, even white-collar jobs will become increasingly vulnerable. The solution lies in preparing for changes before they become too drastic. The government and organizations need to start planning for this new era of social and economic disruption. Climate change, a megathreat to humanity. Climate change is a looming megathreat that is already causing significant destructive impacts on our environment, economy, and way of life. The global population is skyrocketing, while the water supply is dwindling. Planting seasons are becoming less predictable, leading to agricultural unreliability and land barrenness. Climate change has become a perfect storm of political, economic, and social upheaval. If ignored, it will cause irreversible damage to our planet, making pandemics more probable and leading to mass migration, especially in developing countries. To mitigate its effects, we must tax carbon and cease subsidizing fossil fuels. Governments need to invest more in green and renewable energy, halting the adoption of policies that drive humanity off a cliff. The Demographic Dilemma As the aging population puts a strain on government budgets, cutting the workforce to reduce costs can lead to a knock-on effect. It affects productivity, quality of service, and places a strain on remaining employees. It also reduces demand, which can lead to more layoffs. The increasing number of adults relying on government benefits results in these programs becoming unaffordable. Even affluent nations face pressure to fulfill long-term health care and pension obligations. Economists like Danny Roderick argue that the effects of an aging population can be mitigated by encouraging immigration and embracing free trade. Nevertheless, new solutions may not be popular, but not acting will result in worse consequences. The economy as a human body. The economy can be better understood as a human body, with the central bank as the brain and the commercial banks as the heart. Businesses and customers serve as the muscles, and any failure of these parts can cause problems. Central banks have taken on new roles in response to economic conditions, such as flooding advanced economies with liquidity through quantitative easing. While this has spurred growth, it has also raised concerns about asset bubbles. Domestically and internationally, central banks face challenges to maintain the dollar's status as a reserve currency. Major reform is needed in central banks, as their outdated technological systems and policies create inequality. Alternatives like central bank digital currencies are being considered, but there are significant risks associated with decoupling from traditional systems. Overall, the status quo is not working, and change is necessary.
After engaging with Rubini's book summary on omega 3s readers should understand the importance and repercussions of acting proactively to mitigate these pressing threats. Policymakers, industry leaders, and communities must acknowledge the consequences of unsustainable debt, the societal disruption caused by artificial intelligence, the urgency of climate change, the implications of an aging population, and the challenges faced by central banks. Through this awareness, the hope is that governments and individuals may strive to devise innovative, long-term solutions and possess the willingness to implement necessary changes, even if they may be unpopular, to create a more sustainable global landscape.